Hi, I'm Ryan from Foxtech, and today I'm going to show you how to use the Photo Booth app on your iPad. Photo Booth is a fun, easy to use app that's been around for quite some time. And while it might not be as popular as it once was, it still offers a bit of nostalgic charm and simple functionality for those who want to play around with different photo effects. To get started, open the Photo Booth app on your iPad. Once you're in, you'll see a series of effect icons lined up at the bottom of the screen. These effects are what make Photo Booth unique, allowing you to apply a variety of fun and quirky filters to your photos. Tap on one of these icons to choose an effect. The screen will immediately show how the effect looks in real time, so you can frame your shot with the effect already applied. Next, position yourself or your subject within the iPad's screen. The live preview will help you get the shot just right. When you're ready, simply tap the shutter button to take the photo. It's as easy as that. After taking a photo, you can view it by tapping the thumbnail that appears in the bottom corner of the screen. From here, you can swipe left or right to review other photos you've taken during the session. If you want to share or save a photo, tap the share icon and select your desired option, whether it's sending it to a friend or saving it to your device. All the photos you take with Photo Booth are automatically saved to the Photos app on your iPad, specifically in the Recents album. This makes it easy to go back and find your Photo Booth creations later on. Now, it's worth mentioning that Photo Booth isn't as popular as it used to be, especially with the rise of more advanced photo editing apps and social media platforms that come with their own built-in filters. These newer tools offer a lot more options and flexibility for editing and sharing photos. However, Photo Booth is still available and can be a fun way to capture moments with a bit of a retro feel. It's more of a novelty these days, but it's a great option if you're in the mood for something simple and playful. And that's how you use Photo Booth on your iPad. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tech tips. See you later.